Hey guys, it's me back again, and today I'm going to show you this V12 Lego engine I made. So, this engine here runs with a drill, and the drill connects into this drive shaft here. This holds up the drive shaft here, and this is a Lego truck wheel. And then this goes into the crankshaft at the bottom, you can slightly see it there. And then, yeah, this is the, this is the, and, and then it controls... The, um, it, this is the first thing it controls then it goes through these two cogs here then these two and it goes through this one as well so V12 engine so I'm very quickly gonna start it up So, this V12 engine is basically one they would have in ships, etc. And, well, it's very powerful because it's got tw um, 12 pittons, of course. So, yeah, I'm going to restart it again, and then you can have a look at the front. So as you see what happens there, so what happens is that when I do it, I need to lift up the drill on a certain angle so it doesn't um, affect the shaft here. So, let's get my phone in the right position. So there we go. So it's got a, there we go, it goes back in again. So I'm just going to very quickly get something to put underneath the drill to pull it up. Okay, so I've put it back up now. So I've put I've put it back up now. So now, as you can see, it's ready again. So Okay, so now I'm going to take off one of the piston hatches, show you what's inside. So it's very simple because when you take it off, all you need to do is pull one side and it just pops off like that. So, basically, how the pistons. So, these are the pistons here. As you can see, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Six on each side. So that's what makes it a V12 because it's in a V shape and six pistons on each side, so there's 12. So here are the Lego pistons. Here is the bit that I just took off. So now I'm going to start it off again. Oops, just came out again. So what just happened here is that it vibrated and then when it vibrated the the wheel came out. So it's basically how Okay. So there we go, I fixed it again. So what's happened is is that when I start it up the vibrations make it move forward slightly and then the crankshaft comes out. So now I'm going to start it up again. So you can see it, the engine moving, so that's the wheel. Here's the engine and the piston. So that's the engine. So now I'm going to take the um, drill off and show you how uh, what connects the drill to the engine. So I've unscrewed the drill from the main engine. So this is the drill here. 
It's a Bosch. So here's where it connects to on this Lego piece that connects the two rods together. Um, don't quite know the name, but this is the rod here. When that spins, the main engine spins with it here. So but this is basically my Lego engine. Thank you for watching, hope you subscribe, and if you've got any questions about engines, or Lego engines, or anything that you want me to add onto this engine, just say in the comments below. Thank you for watching and hope you, and hope you subscribe. Thank you.